Hey guys, um, wanted to do an EDC update for y'all because I know people really like those. Um, sitting here getting ready for bed, so I figured I'd I'd show y'all, you know, stuff I carry, give you reasonings why I carry, and bump the tripod again. Um, so. Like the last one, which y'all should go watch and make fun of. Um, get the boring stuff out of the way. Keys. Only thing really cool about them is I got this little little twisty light. It's great. Works fine. You know, keys are keys. Lighter. Um, work with a lot of guys that... Um, you know, if you work with guys that smoke or whatever sometimes their lighter goes out and so you're there to save the day um let's see here i've got nicotine pouches and i'm gonna take this off camera real quick because there's my work id and y'all don't need to know like my real name and junk um sit right here so like if if this is the front, it'll sit like on my hip. I've got a tourniquet and then I've got a pen that because uh, I got to write stuff down at work and stuff like that. Um, over here, still rocking the spew. Works great. Um, rocking the Leatherman rebar. I've had this for... I want to say five, six years at this point, and it's held up pretty good. That sheath looking worn out. Um, over here, I got like some generic. Uh, let's see, is there a name on here at all? One Tigris. Cool. So it's a One Tigris. I think it's like a generic pouch. I think you use it for whatever. Got the, the Streamlight Polytech. You know, works good for me. Um, let's see, do I have anything in that pocket? That pocket would be where my phone would go, but I'm recording with it. Back pocket right here. I've got a Kershaw something or other. Uh, I'm, I want to say it's a blur, but I don't know. I don't know for sure. Um, buddy gave it to me. Used to work at a gun shop selling guns in some sort of Springfield Armory program. And he sold Springfields to people and got points. And he ended up getting two of these, so he gave me one of them. Works great. Uh, I definitely... You can, you can kind of see it. I, I uh, use it quite a bit, and I need to sharpen it. Um... Let's see. Oh, I was helping my buddy today and uh, got some free little wire out of it. Um, wallet. Um, let's see, I don't keep anything in this pocket because it would be uncomfortable and be right in the uh, the bend of my knee, and that's uncomfortable. I did get this. Um, I think just before New Year's. I don't remember for the life of me what that company is. I can't remember at the moment. Um, it's some pouch. Like some medical pouch to keep in my back pocket. I got some compressed gauze and some gloves. Um, just so I can have a little bit more capability than just the tourniquet. Um... So yeah, that's everything in the pants, and then, of course, I'm, you know, rocking the uh, MP 2.0 Compact, TLR1HL, um, chambered, I think these are V-crowns, or no, oh no, they're Fioki something or other. 
but rocking that. Um, really wish I remembered the name of the company that did this extension. Um, because it, it's, I ended up getting it on sale and it's, it works. Um, so that's the gun setup. And then, uh, of course, if I'm going to like church, I have a, I have a bag specifically for church. If I go to work, I have my work bag, stuff like that. But that's what I carry on me. Um, and I can pair up and pair down depending on, you know, uh, where, um, you know, depending on where I'm going and what I'm doing. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's pretty much, that's, that's what I carry every day. Um, let me know if you think I'm missing something. Uh, let me know what y'all carry. Um, but other than that, that's, uh, that's the EDC. That's the, that's the whole EDC video this time. Um, things that have changed from the last time I did an EDC video. Um, I strongly advise against your tourniquet that you carry being a SWAT T. Um, or a RATS. I strongly advise against both of those tourniquets. Uh, cat or a SWAT would be what, a, or not, no, not SWAT, soft, soft T. Uh, those two, they're great. They work good. Don't buy, you know, a, don't buy a cheap tourniquet made out of Chineseium. Um, also, I want to, Oh, no, this is a Maxpedition. Okay, this is a Maxpedition tourniquet pouch. Um, buy a genuine North American Rescue tourniquet. Um, all of your medical equipment, aside from, like, you can buy, like, generic gauze. But, like, trauma, life-saving equipment. Buy stuff that's, that's going to work. Um, the, you know, the, the ones you can get for like, it's like a two pack of cat tourniquets for 10 bucks on Amazon. Stay away from those. Um, but yeah, other than that, that's, uh, that's the EDC setup and, uh, yeah, man, I need to, and see, this is, like I said in, in the last video or the video before. I think it was a video before. I'm recording. I recorded this one and two others that you'll end up seeing before this one. Um, gear wears out. Like you know, that's that's looking looking pretty rough there. I'm gonna have to buy another tourniquet. Um, but yeah, when you carry stuff, it wears out. Um, that's why you should buy quality things, so that way when you carry them, it wears out, you know, in a longer span of time versus, you know, two weeks. So, alright. I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.